A few bumper stickers and posters at an Albemarle County Middle School have some people sounding off. CBS 19's Stephanie Satchel joins us live in the newsplex to explain the controversy. Well, Beth, bumper stickers poking fun at Alaska Governor Sarah Palin and posters about peace in Mother Earth leave some parents questioning an Albemarle County teacher, many wondering if she's sending a biased message to her students. We couldn't get inside Henley Middle School today, but this is just a look at one of the pictures that has people talking. Radio talk show host Rob Schilling is blogging about these bumper stickers on display in Margie Shepard's 8th grade classroom. And he says his listeners are outraged. You know, the response that we've had to the blog post and the response that I've had by phone and by voicemail and email is that people are very, very upset. This is a problem when people see nothing but peace, 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 and we should disarm, essentially, the disarmament message, the globalist message. School leaders are backing the eighth grade teacher, claiming she has a right to display the items as long as she follows the state and school board policy by presenting a counterbalance of ideas. Ms. Shepard is a veteran teacher, and she knows very well that when you present a lesson and you present um, current issues, political issues, there is no question that you must present a balance. Uh, take a balanced approach to this. Schilling says from the pictures he's seen, there doesn't seem to be much of a balance. I haven't seen the entire classroom, but I think having a picture of a governor of Alaska who happens to be a Republican who was a vice presidential candidate and implying that she's an airhead is completely inappropriate no matter what else you have posted in the classroom. Schilling isn't asking for these posters to come down. He just wants to see an even balance. I'd love to see the pro-Republican stickers or I'd love to see the peace through strength stickers. I'd love to see something referencing God instead of Mother Earth. I didn't see any of that. Maybe it's up there, but I doubt it. Right now, school leaders are supporting Shepard, saying she has done nothing wrong. Now, if you have any questions or concerns about the items on display, school leaders encourage parents to call Henley Middle School now. Live in the news, like Stephanie Satchel, CBS 19 News. Okay. Margie Shepard, I'm a teacher in the uh, in the middle school in the county. I'm a resident. I don't like the school board budget. I think it cuts the cuts are too deep. The lack of movement on new programs is too stultifying, and the movement towards our goals has been negated, in my opinion. And that doesn't even touch on my salary, but I'm not here to talk about that, at least not tonight. I mean, uh, what did we do to deserve <clears throat> the meager that meager ration? Uh, but you've heard me on that topic before also, so... Pick on teachers and the poor, that's just wrong. You all let them sway you to cut six cents from our rate, tax rate last year, that was wrong also. We are a better place than that. We want to be the best county in Virginia, not the one aiming to attract every miser with a grudge. Every miser with a grudge, grudge, grudge. grudge. grudge.